Hey guys, Snatchy Elephant here again. And today I'm going to show you the step-by-step -step process on how to get Mumble. Uh, first, you want to go to mumble.com and you will come up to a screen that looks like this. Next, you'll click the Mumble Client 1.2.3. Uh, I just do it without the, the mumble.com skin. So we'll go from here when it downloads. Alright, then you're going to open it up. You're going to run the program. Here you're going to come to a install wizard. You want to hit next. You want to accept. Next again. Next. And then install. Now keep in mind guys that I'm using Windows 7 so it might look a little bit different for you guys as you show. So we're going to finish after we're done here. So here I'm going to minimize this. I'm going to find Mumble for you. Just a second. Right here. We're going to run Mumble. Okay. So you're going to come up to something probably like this. Um, if this is your first time doing it, you want to connect. You're probably going to have to uh, um, register I've already registered with them, so I, apparently it's already saved, so it's not going to be able to do much for you. Um, so, Also, you're going to run through the audio wizard probably at the beginning, so I'll show you this too. For the audio wizard, you want to hit next. You want to make sure the device that you're using is actually working. You'll be able to hear yourself in an echo. You'll hear these through the talk. Go past all this. You'll see the voice volume right here when you talk. You can adjust it with the slider. And then the most of the time it's probably going to have you on, uh, instead of push to talk, it's going to have continuous voice. So uh, let's pretend that this says continuous and we'll go to the next. Um, here, balanced is probably the best option for you. I have a custom. Down here you want to use, uh, you won't have the keep option. Instead you want to use text to speech right here. Hit next next and I don't care about submitting to them so there you go so that'll be set up now you want to go to configure you want to turn text to speech off then you'll go to settings and then you will come here to a screen like this uh, this will say continuous for you so we'll go to shortcuts uh, here you're not gonna have anything so it'll look like this Then you want to click add you hit the drop down menu push to talk and then click the shortcut and click the button you want to use. For me I use the middle scroll button on my mouse so I just click it to talk click apply click OK. Next thing you want to do is server. Connect to a server. These are all the public ones that you can go to if you want to just check other ones out um, but if not you add new I'm going to use my server the address Uh, the port for mine, this is the default port, and then my username. And then when I click OK, it's going to connect, and then you can just click on it and then click connect. And there we go. Here we are. I'm in here. It's locked in. So, yeah, that's pretty much it as far as configuration goes. So, hope this helped you guys out. Thanks.